Hello everyone, this is a tutorial video about how to keep your on cloud files secure. In nowadays, people are starting to store their documents on cloud storages such as Dropbox, SkyDrive, Google Drive. By doing this, they can access those files easily from all kinds of different devices. However, um, the cloud features doesn't really assure hackers that they couldn't get into the cloud account. To add one more layer of security to your files, we can use some encrypting service before we upload the files to the cloud storage. So then, um, when the hackers hack into your account, they wouldn't have the access to open and read your files. Today, we will be showing how to do it. Do this by using Dropbox and Boxcryptor, the encrypting service. Um, so we open up the browser, and if you don't have Dropbox and if you don't have Dropbox yet, go ahead and download it. Download the application to your computer and sign up for it. It's really easy. There's only a few fields to fill on. After you have downloaded, also install it and go to Boxcryptor, search for it. It should be the first result that come out from Google. Click on it and download Boxcryptor. Boxcryptor is a encrypting service that uses um, AES-256 and RSA algorithms to um, keep the files encrypted. It's really hard to be decrypted. And so um, also, during the installation, the Boxcryptor might ask you that um, they are going to create a virtual drive on your computer. When you see this, um, just click yes or OK to keep the installation going. After installing those two programs on your computer, I start to um, I start to use it. So first of all, we log into our Dropbox. So my Dropbox is linked to the computer, so um, I don't need to like type the password and username. I can see that it's logged in with the little icon here. And to encrypt our files and upload to Dropbox, uh, we have to open Boxcryptor. And first of all, we have to sign up for an account. So just go ahead and fill in those fields and click on OK. Create an account. Go back and then log in your Boxcryptor as well. Remember, you have to log into your Dropbox and Boxcryptor. Log in. Yeah. Um, so um, after logging in, double click on your Boxcryptor icon again. And you can see that the Dropbox folder is in the box scripter. Um, not only Dropbox, but also other cloud storage program that you have on your computer will be showed here automatically. So now I only have Dropbox on my computer. Um, so to encrypt the file, click on the Dropbox folder from box scripter. Remember, we have to open the Dropbox folder from box scripter. Um, so let me show you again. We have to open it from Boxcryptor and then Dropbox. And it will direct you to the Dropbox folder. So for example, if we want to encrypt this um, test file into our Dropbox, we simply just drag it and move it into here. At the same time, it will ask you that um, if you want to encrypt the file, click on encrypt. Then your file will be encrypted and then upload it on Dropbox. Um, so how do we know if it is encrypted? Let's open up your Dropbox. So here, this is the Dropbox folder and this is the Boxcryptor folder with Dropbox. We can see that, let's make it to the same icon. Okay, we can see that the test file in the Boxcryptor folder has a green name and here it's just a regular name and as you look closely you can also see that right here in the box script folder the test document is it is just a text document however in the Dropbox folder when you click on it it is a box script file which means that it has been encrypted to double check it um, we click on it to open you can see that we couldn't open it. 
So if we open it with um, if we open it just with Notepad as its original document format, open. Yeah, we couldn't see anything. It's just a junk of strange words. But however, if we open the document from the box crypto folder, we can see the original document. So this has been successfully encrypted and uploaded to Dropbox. Yeah, and uh, next time when you want to access those files, remember you have to um, open a document from Box Crypter and then go to Dropbox folder and open the file. Otherwise, you couldn't open it. And so you have now you have your document encrypted and uploaded on Dropbox. Remember, all the different computers that you used, um, if you want to access those encrypted files, you need to have Box Crypter and Dropbox installed on the computer. Then you will be able to view the sensitive documents. Also, the Box Crypter also um, have a feature. If you right click on it and go to Box Crypter, there's, there's a manage permission. Click on it. You can see that here's a add user. You can add your friend or family who will also want to um, see this document and if they have the Box Crypto account, yeah, for, they need to um, register for an account for it. For the ad group, you need to pay for Box Crypto to use, to use this function. So yeah, for the free version, we can use the ad user. Okay. Yeah. So basically, this is how you um, encrypt your file and upload it into Dropbox. Hope you enjoyed the um, tutorial video. Thank you very much.